This is an instructional video on the functions of a mix pre and how to connect your Sennheiser shotgun mic to your GVC HM100 camera. The mix pre is a Studio 2 channel portable stereo microphone preamplifier or mixer. With a 1 kHz tone oscillator, the mix pre has impressive audio skills and comprehensive features, making it ideal for front end studio or field production. Two very handy features include the high pass filter and the limiters. The high pass filter allows you to remove any low frequencies that's caused by wind, vibrations and so on. The 80 hertz position is appropriate for recording general speech, music and ambient sounds. The 160 hertz is useful to enhance speech clarity. Like so, you hear me now at 80 hertz. When you click to 160, my voice should be much more clearer. Before you begin setting up, make sure you have the following equipment. Your, pre, your mix pre, LXR loom with two tail ends, including the headphone jack, a pair of headphones, two double A batteries, and a shotgun microphone with a boom pole and wind cover. For outsized productions, you also can use a clip mic depending on what you're recording. Clip mics are also good in interview situations. And make sure that your camera is set up to the correct configuration and make sure you have two SD cards. First, insert your AA batteries into the mixer. Turn both mic channels all the way down and make sure you then turn the headphone volume halfway up. A warning light will appear red when the headphone volume is too loud. Take the XLR cables and plug them into the line outputs on the right hand side of the mixer. Then take the other end and plug them into your camera audio LXR. Make sure that the colours match the corresponding colours connected to the mixer. Both audio select switches must be on manual and use the audio dials to create a sensible level following the levels that come up on the LCD screen. Now to connect the mic. Connect the LXR cable to the channel 1 mic input on the left hand side of the mixer. On the left hand side of the mixer make sure the 48B is on and also the switch next to it should be in the 80 position. Then make sure the switch next to that is also on. Fade up the appropriate channel mixer until you see signal coming through. And now you're ready to record.